Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to create prints for different variants in Knit. So, first of all guys, I will need you to watch this video from now till the end without making any skip or passing this video because every single detail is really important to do and to make. And of course, if you skip something, you might appear or face a problem or an error during your creation of this those different variants that we are going to talk about today. So without any further talking, let's get ahead with this video. First of all guys, I will need you to go ahead and open Printful. So let's go ahead and open it. So here we go. And from here guys, I will need you to go to Printful.com. So let's click on it. And of course from here, just create an account and log in into it. Now guys, as you can see, this is my account. So this is the home page, preferences, premium, and so on. So now we are going in this video to create various kind of products using Printful. So we are not going to stick with one product, but we are going to like pick each product and make one example of each. So let's start for example with clicking on product template and click on create your first product. Here guys, I'm going to choose um uh, let's pick for example home and living. So we're gonna start for with home and living. And uh, let's make a cup or mug uh, design. So let's make a bug design. Here I'm going to choose, for example, uh, this one. Let's go with this one. And let's click on it. So here we go. Now, all you need to do is wait until it loads. So here it is. And of course, here you just have to drop your design. So for me, I'm going to drop a random image. It's not that professional, but for you, you can drop whatever image you have. So here I'm going to make it like that and duplicate the design on both sides. So it's going to be something around this. And or let's keep it that way. All right, all right. Now what I'm going to do is click here, choose which one of these, and I think I will keep it that way. All right, design for each product size. And now when I'm done, let's have a 3D review. So that's how the cap is going to look like. Uh, pretty decent. So if I move it around here, let's see how it will look like. Uh -huh. Okay, I think I'm going to keep it simple. So let's make it in the middle and that's it. Now let's go back to here. So continue. And click on get it. So let's go back over here. Uh, keep designing. Now let's click it here. And this, that's it. So now all I need to do is add the name for the product. So let's name it for example, tutorial mag. So here we go. And now click to save and you have created your first product. Now let's create a new product. Let's make a new one. So let's go to collections. And here I'm going to actually make it on these collections. So promotional gifts. Let's see, for example, um, I think I'm going with the case. Okay, this looks good. So let's go with the case. Um, which one are we going to use? I'm going with this one size it's for iPhone so here I'm going to pick iPhone 11 and here I'm going to drop the design so let's click here apply and here it is so this is the design and here don't show again and here you can move it drag it whatever you'd like let's make it around here and finally now all you need to do for example to go here you can add the text over the design so let's add for example a uh, text so you can make for example the customer when it asks you to uh, get him the case you can ask him if you wanted to, to write your name on it for example here i'm going to type um lowly which is my name and i will add it for example over here we can make it smaller and we can add some quick design so i'm going to add for example apple let's see if we can find it let me just remove this apple and let's search for it so here we go now let's give it some time until it loads i don't think they have anything that has relationship with apples so i'm going to keep it simple um i'm going to use this one and i'm going to add it right over here on the the, the case now all you need to do now is wait for it until it loads and then click on continue 
and everything will be set up for you so let me just refresh the page so uh, let's click here exit page let me just copy this real quick paste this over here uh, I think we have some glitch around here and basically when you finish you do the same thing which is just naming the products and it will be all good as you can see here now what is the third thing that we have to create for example so now we are trying in this video to create various kind of products so you can know how to use each kind of theme so let's try now for example uh, kids in your closing from here guys I'm going to choose for example all shirts and I'm going to choose this black shirt so here we go click on it and here it is so here we go with the shirt this is the shirt that you have chosen now let's click here to drop the design so click here click on apply and the image shall be added of course if you want here and you change the kind of printing so if I choose DTG printing the quality of the image will be so much better so let's try this out here we go and here it is and what this will actually do is make the quality better and the second thing which is gonna do is make the quality or like the image much bigger so you can add the image whatever you like here in the center uh, this is much better than the, the normal which is the embroidery uh, printing so I'm going to use this one here you can add the kind of cause for t-shirt so I'm going to choose black gray and let's put here blue and then go to design here you can add for example the same thing add text uh, clip parts or add quick design and finally here we click on continue and here we go with the t-shirt so t-shirt um, tutorial and click on save product templates here we go now we have created a cup a t-shirt so let's try to actually create something else which is the final thing that we're gonna end this video with so let's click on brand and let's click for example here on adidas and here we can pick one of the things so i'm going to do this and basically guys here you can actually get a real bag from like a famous brand and add your image onto it as well so let's click on apply and let's product here we don't have any kind of different printing uh, categories so i'm going to do something like that we can add for example your image your thing whatever you'd like here i'm going to click on continue and then here you do the same thing which is naming the product and click on save so yeah guys that's how you can create variant amount of products in printful so please guys if you like this video please leave a like and thank you guys for watching